Alright, let's go ahead and get going here. And yes, redstone is extremely difficult. But I don't have too much to figure out here. Turn it down a little bit more for me, more than for you guys, actually. Right around there, maybe. Nah, I can turn down my headphones. Alright, first of all, hi everybody, welcome. Sefg here. It me, Sefg. Redstone is easy. <laughs> Says you. Says you. Redstone is so hard to wrap my brain around. Uh, so here's the deal. Uh, if you've read the title, you know what we're making already. Uh, also, I've decided to name this series of streams, because basically all these Minecraft streams have been is just me trying to make crazy redstone shit. So, and I really want to learn how to use redstone, because I'm fascinated by it. So I'm just going to start calling these streams, uh, Let's Learn Redstone. That's a, that's a workshop name. I'm going to come up with something better later on. Uh... Yeah, I want to learn how to make red. I want to learn how to do redstone stuff, and I have a bit of a hoarding problem in Minecraft. I uh, I never. I'm really bad about getting rid of junk, which is why I need to be able to throw that junk away. So, we're gonna be making some trash cans today. Ah, uh, now. Also, I should say, hey, how's, how's everyone doing? I'm really bad. At, I, I'm so self-centered. I never talk to you guys. How are you guys doing? What's up, everybody? How's everyone doing today? Where did the fiber goal go? Oh, yeah, I pulled it down so I could do Rubik's Cube. Oh, everyone's having a good day. But, yeah, uh, we're making trash cans today. I actually already have... I've been teasing this a little bit. Ugh, excuse me. So you guys probably already know that I've already been working on this. Come on. Come on. There we go. I've already been working on this a little bit, and I built this. I built this right here. The idea behind this, this is a junk donation chest, so you can toss whatever junk you don't need in here. We'll keep some of that. Actually, you toss whatever junk you don't need in here, then you flip this lever. Why is that still playing through my speakers? All right, well, it's playing through my speaker for some reason, but there's clicking happening. But as you can see, all the shit's gone. Uh, let me close and reopen Minecraft real quick. This Minecraft is goof in here. I wasn't wearing my headphones earlier, so I had it playing through the speaker on my monitor over here. There we go. That's better. But yeah, it's just a junk donation chest. You toss stuff in, pull a lever, and then it's gone. Uh, yeah, so we go under here. Yep, we can see the redstone down here below. Um, I... Oh, I broke the lever. Whoops. Whoopsies. Uh, you need to stay here. I think, yeah. Yep, so I actually built the system on my own, so I'm kind of proud of it. This, this is the first time I actually built something where I, like, didn't... I, I didn't need any, like, input from, like, the internet or anything. I didn't have to look anything up. I just figured it out for myself. But uh, you have these droppers, okay? First of all, if you don't know, okay, poppers, right? They collect items. They pull items from ch any containers that they are that are above them, uh, one at a time, and they can push items into containers that are uh, they are connected to. But if you run a redstone charge through them, it locks them. So if I put a lever in here, it won't go down to the, the dropper below because it's locked. All right. Uh, and then you have droppers here. Uh, droppers actually carry a redstone charge, which I didn't know, uh, which makes this next bit easier. Uh, if you run a constant redstone charge through the, the droppers, like from a lever, for example, 
uh, then it'll transfer that charge to the hoppers and lock them. And then when you turn the, the droppers off, you have your observer down here that is making note of uh, the change in state of the block, which so it's releasing a charge every single time the hopper turns on and off, which is activating both of them. And so it's just constantly just draining items out of here. All right. But yeah, I, I designed this one all on my own, and I'm really proud of it. It was, it was a lot of work. Uh, but the thing is, although I teased this design and talked it up a lot, uh, it's not the final design. This isn't the this is not the design we're going with. I think the lever was over here. Yeah. Uh, this is not the final design we're actually going with. Uh no, because I was doing a little bit of research on these bad boys, redstone comparators. Because redstone comparators actually uh, have the cool ability to uh, measure how much stuff is in a chest and then transfer redstone charge based on that. So I actually ended up seeing something in a video. Uh, even, even though I just got done talking up how like I built I built this all by myself, but I saw something in a video that was better and way simpler, and so I adapted that to a new design. Right here. Don't never mind this other ship over here. Uh, this is the design. It's a barrel. Just a normal, ordinary barrel. Except not really. It's actually a magic barrel. Uh, anytime you toss something in here, it disappears. And then it's supposed to go off, but I think something's broken down here. Yeah, it's supposed to activate, but I, I think something's wrong. Oh, I see the problem. There we go. I had a single little goofy going on down here. Yep, uh, this is the new design that we're actually going to be building. Uh, it's a lot, it's a lot more simple. Uh, it's very compact, so you can just hide it all. You can hide all the mechanics under the ground. It's a lot less expensive to build. But yeah, you just toss stuff into the barrel, and then it disappears. Uh, so if I run over here, uh, I'm going to set it to daytime real quick. Time set day. This is what's buried on the ground uh, right here. Uh, you dig down three blocks, okay? And then you have your... Just imagine this, but three blocks lower, right? Uh, you have your comparator, okay? That's measuring how much crap is in the dropper. Uh, when, it, when the comparator sees something in the dropper, uh, it activates this redstone clock, uh, which makes the dropper activate, uh, and then it goes away. So if I have this right, the, the redstone comparator outputs to this redstone here uh, by charging this block, I believe. Uh, then it then this redstone charges this block, which charges that redstone below uh, beneath it, which charges this block, this stone block, which charges this repeater, and then it runs all the way back to the chest. I think that's how it works. I'm not entirely sure. I am very much a beginner in redstone. Yeah, so yeah, you just have stuff you toss in the barrel, and it just goes away into lava. And yeah, there's like lava beneath this. But yeah, uh, it's a it's a much simpler design. It's four blocks, some redstone dust, uh, a repeater, and a comparator, and some other shit. But yeah, uh, because it's so simple, though, uh, that means that we actually get to make multiples of these. And it's actually going to fill two needs in the John Ball server. Uh, one, uh, it fulfills the need of me needing to get rid of my junk. Because I have way too much excess shit. And two, uh, there are a lot of holes from creepers around the village, as I'm sure a lot of you are aware. And those holes need to go away.
so we can solve that today too. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna fill in. We're gonna use the trash cans as an excuse to possibly uh, fill in some of the holes. Also, as you can see, I already built a trash can in here, which actually led to some tragedy. I Quake came in here uh, to visit and saw the barrel before I had put the lape the the sign on it. And so he put his elytra, his shulker box, and a lot of other important things in the ch in the barrel, and they got trashed. <laughs> and it was just like, oh no. <laughs> yeah, Quake Quake lost a lot of his items to this trash can, which is why I made a sign for it. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna build like five more of these. This is the plan today. Uh, just around the Bala Village. Maybe I'll head out, uh, in, off in that direction, uh, near the 100 by 100 to build one there too. But as you can see here, we already have everything we need. Uh, I came in here earlier, uh, like an hour ago, and just quickly got all this together. Thanks, I didn't want to waste anyone's time by just, because normally I end up just scrambling during the stream to get it all ready. I didn't want to do that this time. I'll take that axe, actually. Um, we're gonna put all of this away, keeping you for Silk Touch. Stop why Pog is almost dead, and I can't fix it. I can't fix it. <laughs> it's too expensive for an experience. Um, I guess we'll keep... We have some shit we can get rid of right now, actually, in the trash can. Some things I don't need. I don't really need bone meal. Um, what else do we have? We can get rid of. Uh, I can just make more doors. Making room. The whole point of this. Lovely. Yeah. Oh yeah. Slabs too. Bye bye. But yeah, okay, now that we have some room here, let's get to work. Lovely. Alright, so first things first, we need to do some location scouting. We need to figure out where we're going to be building these trash cans. Um, we should probably have one uh, in the middle of town. Oh yeah, we also have to find the holes. Uh, they've been, like, patched up. So we gotta figure out where the holes all are before we can, you know, fill them. Uh, there's a big hole over there by the iron, the iron farm. Which, once again, there's an iron golem outside the farm. There's probably gonna be, there's gonna be plenty of time at once we finish building all the trash cans, I'm pretty sure. So I might just use some of the extra time to fix the iron farm on stream. Uh, there's a hole here we could use. It needs to be filled in. And uh, that might be good. Up. Uh, yeah, right. And it's next to the iron farm too, which is nice because you can throw away the poppies we don't need. Um, so I might put one there. Um, I want to make sure they're in convenient spots. I'm trying to balance like filling in holes and like having convenience. Ooh, we should put one in the nether too. Be nice. Uh, having one near the the mob farm, the the spire would be nice. I know there's a hole around here somewhere. There's like, yeah, there's mobs that spawn under the ground because the holes aren't filled all the way in. Yeah, there's a hole right here. Yep, we could definitely use this hole. Uh, right next to the trading post, too, which is nice. Uh, do this. I'm just using another rack. The tower up. Okay. Yep, so... Yeah, I, again, though, I want to, like, make sure that it looks nice, too. Because I don't want to mess up the, the aesthetic of the village. The aesthetic. 
Um, is there just a random, like, dirt block missing right here for some reason? Why is that missing? That's kind of funny. Um... I'm putting a here could be nice, too. I heard the spider hiss again. Where are these spiders at? Oh, well, there's water down there. Got any recipes, though. That's neat. I'm listening for the spider hisses and bat screeches and such. Oh, here we go. Oh, this is a really good spot for one, actually. I'm gonna dig down over here. Yeah, it just goes into a fucking cave. <laughs> This could be a good spot. Yeah. Oh, show. Yeah, I have a ton of netherrack on me right now for a reason that I'm probably going to show you guys uh, in a minute. Um, let's just start, let's just start building some. Um, I like the idea of having one next to here. I'm not going to worry much about filling in holes, actually. I take that back. I'm just going to build paths to the trash cans, and then we'll go from there. Let's, ha let's have one here outside the trading post. Um, We'll put it going, like, this way. Yeah. And have the barrel be, like, right here. Okay. So you have to go three blocks down. There is a hole here, so it works out. Um, I don't know how long it needs to be. So I'm just going to wing that part. We can wing it for that part of the plan. Uh, yes, okay. Some of this stuff away. Let's see if I remember how to do this. Uh, we need a dropper that's upside down. Okay. Uh, give me some of that cobblestone. That axe away. I'm not gonna need it very much. Alright. Oh, I got an upside down dropper. Fuck it. Okay. Got that started. Next on our list of things. Uh, where do we go? Where do I want to go from here? Uh, let's put the hoppers in. Two hops this time. One, two. Barrel on top. And there's a spider. Just a random ass spider. Go away! <laughs> the zombies are so loud. Did it maybe come from the cave? There's no cave connected to this, though. Where did that spider come from? Weird. Anyway, uh, comparator. Here we go. Uh, it's going the right way. Thank God. Okay. Take some of this out. I have a soft touch pick. Uh, silk touch pick just in case I need to I, or just in case I mess up with placing the stone but it's not very it's not looking too hot so hopefully hopefully I won't need to worry about that okay but anyway should be just like this 
stone here, dust here, stone, dust. Um, let's see if I can hit this right. Yeah, there we go. And then again over here. I can I can just attach it to the hopper. There we go. There you go. I guess filling in the holes isn't too big of an issue, but... Finding a use for them is nice. Oh, let's go like this. Uh, can I not do that with the uh, dirt? Sad, but okay. Oh, but if I do that, it reveals the hopper beneath. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. Nope. We'll find some, we can find some other way to make it stylish. We're not doing that. Signs. Make sure no one does what Quake did. Um, and it's nighttime. There's a bit over here we can sleep in. Pew! Nice. The thing is, I'm trying to decide what I want to do after this. Oh, why are mobs spawning over here? I need a product to do for after this is done. So I don't, I don't really know where to go from here. Because I have the I have the spire I can work on. Which I'm, you know, avoiding. There's a lot of work. But also, uh, I have some... I don't know. I don't really know what I would want to do after this. Uh, we got to fill this in. This is a lot to fill in, though. Uh, stupid iron golem is making me angry. You're halting the flow of pr iron production, sir. Um, what else can we make these? I, as much as I want to put one there, um, I want to make sure that I want to make sure wherever we put trash cans, they're in like convenient spots. You know what I mean? I don't want them just be placed all willy nilly. Uh, you know, like this is convenient. It's like next to the trading post. Uh. I actually just thought of a way to make the trash cans a little more aesthetically pleasing, but it's a little late now. It's all right. It's fine. It would require like another hopper anyway. It's not worth it. Another hopper and trap doors. And uh, the farm. Oh, there's sheep in here. I can make an automatic sheep farm with those. We may have to revisit this area. Oh, that's said the boomer shack would be a good spot. Um, so arid and dry. Nothing grows here. I find the boomer shack is a good place. And yeah, sure. Having two in the relative area of the village is nice. Uh, we could dig out under the path. Yeah, and as long as troopers don't blow it up, it should be fine. 
So we'll put the barrel right here. See, there's so many holes. There's so many holes around town. Alley! It's another alley raid. Hey, everybody. We're building trash cans. It's it's more it's more interesting than it sounds. I swear. I promise. What's up, everybody? Yeah, we're making uh, we're making trash cans with redstone that are automatic. Uh, how was the stream, Alley? How'd it go? I I stayed for a little bit and then I left. Uh. To get some of the top layer here. It was good. Sweet. That's what we like to hear. Never a dull moment. See, this is why we need to. This is why making these trash cans nice. There's just all this open space underneath the town. So we need to use it for something. Alright. First things first. We need our upside down dropper. Uh, which goes that I it's here. That's good. save some of this dirt for filling in other holes later on that we're going to be making. Uh, lava bucket. Here we go. Okay, droppers in place. Then we make the hoppers. We do the hoppers and the barrels and such. One, two. Ah, barrel. Put our sign on it now. Trash. Hold on. I should not build on this side. That'd be a bad idea. I do not want to place it here. Place it here. There we go. Trash. Can. So that no one gets quaked. <laughs> okay. Uh, down again. Now, uh, we start doing the fun redstone stuff. I could make it reversed, I think. I think that would work. It'd be It's going to be backwards in my brain, so it's going to take me a second, but... Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Okay, so we need comparator here, going that way. And we have a bit of redstone dust connecting it to a repeater. Uh, God, doing this backwards is going to really fuck with me. It's going to really mess with my brain. Uh, yeah, this is really going to screw with my head. Oh, God. Stone there. Stone there. Uh, we need a stone here. Redstone dust there, redstone dust there. Um, I need to be able to get out of here. <laughs> there we go. Uh there, that should do it. Alright, now I just tower out and bury this. Buried it in the dirt. Just a quick little testy test. Hey, let's go. Alright, that's two. It's two down, three to go. Alright, we've got two in the village. I'm feeling alright about that. Uh now I wanna I think I wanna put one in the desert village off, off this way. Have like one in the desert village. I think I think one, but I think I'm um, filling in that one over here is probably a good idea too. I just need some blocks to help fill that in. I probably have enough now. I think 20 dirt would be enough to do it. 
Let's go fill in the hole. Digging a hole, digging a hole. Digging my grave. I'm gonna need that, gonna need that. I need a shovel back. This is already how many layers? That's the perfect depth. <laughs> perfect. Uh where exactly want we have we have our option we have our choice of where to place this because it's so destroyed. Um Yeah, I think like right about here is good. Yeah, sure. Right about here. Alright. And have it come out this way. Alrighty then, kiddos. Do 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 do. Phenomena. I'm singing competing songs, I just realized. Oopsies. Bam. Yes. I'm gonna need some, uh... I'm gonna need some stones this way, I think. Yeah. There's some blocks. Um, there's some one here. And this should be fine. Um, no, what am I doing? I want it here. Uh, I want it here, and then I want a stone on top of that. Uh, I need a stone here. Redstone. Uh, put the hoppers down. Well, actually, we can do this. Legend. Okay, then... Hopper! Hopper! Barrel! Just to check. Um... Sweet. Okay. Great! That's three down. Two more to go. I know I said this wouldn't take very long, but it's going way faster than I thought it would. <laughs> but it's okay. I'll ha I have something really cool to show everyone uh, after this. All right. Uh, now we got to fill this in. We must bury it. We're not gonna have enough dirt to bury it. Ah. Shoot. We need more dirt. Oh, there goes the squid. Odd IP squid. Squid go rip. Uh, right. <sighs> more dirt. <laughs> Fucking come on. There's so many holes in this town. One of these days, this village is going to get swallowed up in one big sinkhole. <laughs> And it will be really funny, actually. Uh, all right, that's three down. Um, there should be one. We should build one in the desert village. Probably, right? Like, I don't think there needs to be any more here. I mean, I suppose. Night time. Oh. Wouldn't let me 
put the arrow back in because I had a shield, I guess. Or am I out of arrows? Oh, yeah, I put all my arrows away. Ha! <laughs> Oops. Oh, well. Wow. Oh, shit! God damn it! This is why we can't have nice things! Nothing can ever go right. Everything must always go wrong for me. Um, of course, I'm not left with enough materials to fix what just broke. Ah. Uh. Man, I don't have enough shit to fill this in right now. I'm just gonna fill in as much as I can. And just like light the bottom. The mobs don't spawn in here. Yeah, okay. Ah. You know what? I know exactly what we're gonna do for our next goal in life. Uh, I'm lighting up this entire fucking village with torches. They never leave you with enough blocks to just fix what breaks. That's the worst part about creepers. It, it's always just mass destruction. Every single fucking time. Every single time. Alright, I'm gonna have to fix that later. Um... I still, I still kind of want one down this way. These are really easy to make, so I can easily make a bunch of these off stream too. And that'd be totally fine. Um, I want one for the throwaway wheat seeds, but I guess this is close enough. Let's make, let's let's go ahead and make one in Desert Village. And sleep before we go there, because Jeebus. I can't go anywhere without everything breaking. My life really is just like one disaster after another. Moving from one catastrophe to the next. With no end in sight. Ah. <sighs> Bed. Yeah, later on, I'm just tossing torches everywhere. I don't care if it's ugly. Because mobs still spawn in the village, even though it's lit. Eating steak. We have infinite steak farm, it's fine. Okay. Oh yeah, I've, I've been experimenting with minecarts, by the way, uh, in that uh, single-player world. Uh, I've been doing a lot of, like, experimentation with redstone. Why you no work? Why you no go? What the hell? Ah, uh, I see. Someone turned that into a redstone dot, that's why. Yeah, I've been playing around with redstone a lot, and I wanna I wanna do something with minecarts at some point. I'm not totally sure what yet. But at some point. I wanna either like expand this railway or I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't quite know yet. Why is just a random redstone torch here? Um, perfect. There's a hole right here. <laughs> There's a hole right here that needs to be filled. How are we going to fill this with sand, though? Yeah, you know, I got, I got it. It'll work. It'll work out. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Um, I need to put this minecart back in that chest. Build first, and then we worry about the rest later.
this one's gonna have to be kind of funky, but we'll make it work. Space out first. Okay. Um, let's see. Yeah, in the middle of town is fine, I think. Um, we'll have it coming out from the tramway. Maybe like right here. I don't. I don't want to be too in the middle of the road though. Eh, kind of off to the side over here would be fine, I think. Yeah, I'll put it, like, right here. Okay. Um, mean droppers. Give me a lava bucket. There we go. Okay. Um. Let me get rid of this. Wait, how much cobble do I have? I was about to say, we could, like... We could bake it. We could put, uh... We could put solid blocks on the second layer down, and then just put sand on top of it. And that would work for filling this in. Um, this should, this is fine though. We can work it out, as the Beatles once said. All right, uh, grits and comparator, and then we got your dust, and then do that, and then you put these away and get out your stone blocks because you gotta go like a a boo, a boo, boo. Oh. Alrighty. And then I gotta fill this in. Uh which I think it should work out just fine, in theory. Um oh, that's not gonna work out. Okay. Um oh but you know what? We only have two spots that are exposed and we have exactly two sandstone so well i guess that repeater is exposed too damn it hee <laughs> hee oh i want to put that there no i want to put sand there uh sand yeah it's not gonna work okay uh we need more sand something please do not fall on me up um oh but this is gonna be a problem you know what there <laughs> whatever fuck it actually filled in, but it'll look filled in, and that's enough. We need more sandstone now. Is there a way to make sandstone? Ah, it's getting dark again. Great. Wonderful! Um... I mean, at this rate, I might as well just fill in the top with sandstone, but I just want it to match. Uh, that shouldn't mess with the machine at all. There we go. Oh, the hoppers. Almost forgot the most important part. Whoop, I didn't want that string. No, go away. 
Can't forget Hopper, Hopper Barrel. Tada. Trash can. That one odd piece of sandstone sitting there because fucking hell. Um, you know what? I got an idea. Um, okay. Just to make it fit in nicer. Sweet. Uh, need more sandstone. A little more sandstone than this. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Oh, god damn it. God damn it. It's always me. I'm always the one that gets fucked up by creepers. Every single time. God damn it. Uh. More sandstone. Every time. Every time. Whenever life's going a little too well, creepers are always there to remind me that God hates me. <laughs> like, remember, bitch, this is my world. There we go. Eh, I might as well do this too. Uh, yeah. I was gonna see if I had anything nicer, but it doesn't matter. Okay. Here's again. Uh, and I have a lot of sand, so might as well. You know what? Let's conserve the materials. I only need to fill in this spot right here. And then I'll have enough. Should. Um, that'll be fine. More than enough. Okay. We're going back. Get me out of the freaking desert. Please and thank you. Why? Why are those redstones turning into redstone dots? I don't understand. Let's see. We have one more trash can to make, I believe. Uh, the question is, do I want to make this in the nether, or do I want to make it somewhere else? I would like to put one by the 100 by 100, but, I, I, well, if I'm being honest, I, I don't want to go all the way out there again. Every time I stray from the village, shit goes wrong. Even when I'm in the village, shit goes wrong.
Life never goes my way is the point I'm trying to make. Uh, you know what, let's make it another, fuck it. Fuck it. Hang on, I have the minecart, I gotta put the minecart back. On delay. Always good. Oh. Of course mobs would follow me down here. Why not? I'm gonna put a trash can down here, because this is where people become the mine. Yeah, it's a good spot. Um, thinking, processing. Okay. A little spill right here. That one will layer. Okay. I already have a ton of another rack, lucky for me. do this though let's put the dropper and such down now is that deep enough no well I'm getting confused. Um, the dropper needs to go right here. Right? Yeah. Like that. There we go. Okay. Uh, and then put hoppers down. Okay. Uh, brain processing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Um, we need that to go away, and this and this to come out. I know at some point creepers are going to blow up these trash cans because of course they will. They're drawn to everything I create <laughs> with the intent to destroy. But if, eh, if it happens, it happens. Okay. It's still in there. Um, stone here, redstone dust, and stone there. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I'm building this right, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have more faith in myself. Jeez. Okay. Um. Let me just tech, test real fast to make sure. Oh. Um. I don't have my golden boots on. I did not. I can't believe I didn't bring my gold boots with me. I did not mean to place that stone, but we need to get out of here. I'm gonna go get my gold boots real quick, cause I don't feel like killing that big one. Oh, 
nothing can be easy. Everything must always go wrong for me. That's how life works. Gotta go get my gold boots from the house. Go, go, go. Run, run, run. Door open. Boats. I can't believe I actually put my boots away without thinking about it. This is kind of important. I keep the, I keep my gold boots on me all the time, so I just never have to worry about it. It's like the one time I went down there without them. Are you fucking kidding me? Come into the water. Come into the water where you can't destroy anything. I don't care. Whatever. Yeah, that's right. Bitch made. Bitch made creeper. This is the part where I go into the nether and there's a creeper in here. Surprisingly not. Go down, thank you. My bacon is safe this time. Thank God. I was scared. Down below. We good now, Buster Brown? Thank you. Okay. I placed some stone in the panic. Let's get that. Let's go reclaim that. Um. Exactly five left over. This is the math called for. I, I, I get so, I'm bare, I'm terrible at math, as most of you know. So when I get my math right, I am always happy. Here we go. And the final touch. That is sideways. Oh, of course it went in the hopper. It just dropped into the... God damn it. Oh, I, look, I looked in a freaking container. You know what, dude? Keep going. Keep backing up. Keep backing up. Keep going. Come on. Come on. Keep going. Yeah, that's right. F off. Yeah, that barrel just dropped into uh, lava. But you know what? I'm not doing it again. We're done. <laughs> it's over. We won. We can leave now. Mission accomplished. We're good. All right, then. Uh, well, now... We're going to need something to do here. And luckily, I actually have something now that we're done making some really sick trash cans. Uh, for the people still here, I want to show you guys something that I made last night. I've been, I've been trying to make this off stream for some time, and I kept getting, like, killed in the process. I would, like, try it and then, like, give up and come back to it later. Uh, but you know, we're looking, we're sitting pretty right now. So now that it's actually finished, we're just gonna put some stuff away real quick first. And these chests here. 
Uh, I don't need spider eye. Bye bye. That's what it's for. Having that trash can is just so convenient, man. You guys don't even know. It's so nice. I had a shovel in here this whole time. I didn't need to make another one. Whatever. It's fine. Um. Yeah, okay. Real quick, I'm gonna kill this iron golem. I'm taking these with me. We're gonna need this gold for what we're about to do. Yeah, I should have taken some scaffolding. Um, I bet I can get him. I, I gotta kill this iron golem so that he doesn't slip out. We're gonna work on this as soon as once I get done showing you guys what I want to show you. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to reach him. All right, we'll get scaffolding. Thanks to the mighty bamboo farm, I have tons of scaffolding now. And if I ever run out of scaffolding, I can always make a m way more. Stopping by the bamboo farm to find a 64 stack of bamboo in your chest. Ah, feels so good. So good. Alright. Yep, let me kill this iron golem real fast and then we'll change the title of the stream reflect what we are now doing. Going up. Everybody. Got him. Easy. Okay, we're just gonna toss this iron in here. Uh, and that poppy I just got. Guess what? There's a trash can right here. Lovely. Yay. <laughs> okay. Alright, now that that's done and dealt with, we're going to fix that in a second, but first, I want to show you guys something cool. I'm going to put Let's Run Redstone in parentheses. There we go. I want to show you guys something super cool. We're going back to the nether. I saw leaves, and I thought it was a fucking creeper again. And I got scared. I have a permanent phobia of creepers now. But anyway, uh, if you come up this way uh, into the, the wilds of the nether, and you scale this mountain here, you might notice uh, some soul torches off in the distance. And upon further investigation, you might find an iron door. Ooh. And if you enter the iron door, you will find a piglin sitting behind the counter by the name of Shifty Steve the Piglin II. And Shifty Steve, much like his Piglin brothers, dude loves his gold. I'm just gonna load up five. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Piglin Black Market. <laughs> got a glass bottle? Let's see. What else you got for me, Shifty Steve? Come on, give me something good. Word. 
Eh, leather, that's all right. What else you got? I... It took me so long to build this because piglins kept fucking killing me. And it didn't help that- it doesn't help that zombie piglins love to gather in front of the door for some reason. But, finally, I got it built. Off stream. But yeah, uh, Shifty Steve over here just sits on a hopper. Uh, and the, uh, the hopper connects to a chest uh, down here. That was my last one. Okay. Yep. And from this hopper, you just collect whatever you got from trading. But I'm a I'm a trading addict, so I'm gonna go again. Nice. Obsidians, not bad. What else we got? Come on, Shifty Steve, give me something good. More leather. Drop me some pearls, brother. Obsidian. I know I could, totally could have taken the hopper out of the equation, by the way, but I wanted to... Uh, I don't want you to have to, like, jump to put the gold in, so I used the hopper instead. It seemed like a better system. More crying obsidian. Ah, that's not terrible. Alright, well. I don't want to waste all of my gold. But I guess we can take some of this stuff and head back. Been a pleasure, Shifty Steve. I'll uh, see you next week. Uh-oh. Did that little baby piglin just go in there? Yeah. It's okay. Uh, he'll find his way out. See, these soul torches are supposed to be repellent, but all they seem to manage to do is get piglins to go in. They do a very terrible job of keeping them out. Now, I don't know if the piglin will be able to get out because there's soul torches blocking the way. So he might just be forced to stay in the back wall. I'll have to either seal off the black the back wall or uh, put torches in the back, too. And I hope eventually that baby piglin will despawn, though. Yeah, I put a pressure plate by the door deliberately so that piglin, anyone that gets stuck inside the black market can find their way out. But yeah, we now have a Piglin Black Market. It's very cool. I'm super stoked about it because I love gambling. Piglin Gotcha was one of those things I knew right away. As soon as I saw that it was a thing, I wanted to make it. And plus, I, I love... Shifty Steve and his little countertop. It's very funny. Yeah, so I want to show you guys. Uh, we have lots of time left over now. I think what we're going to do... Um, I switched in here, I was in here already, right? Um... I'm storing some stuff, but it's occupying my brain. Uh, we're going to fix the uh, the uh, iron farm. So the iron farm's all right, but it could be better. So we're going to start working on that. Oops. All right, it's got to go up here. Uh, uh, I got a lot of soul sand now, which is good because I want to start work. I want to work on a, a an elevator. For future projects. I also have some oak trap drawers in here because I want to make a crawl space. These crawl spaces are cool. Anywho, I uh, might need these stones for the stone cutter in a minute here. 
Yeah, so we need to work out some stuff with this iron farm. Because it's good, it's working, but it's not as efficient as it could be. My main problem is that iron golems spawn and then they get they somehow fall out of the farm. And that's bad. Sniper war. I managed to miss the skeleton two times and hit the spider instead two times. Because I'm just that good at Minecraft. Okay. You gotta change the title again. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna change the title now, and y'all are gonna keep that that my that black market a secret. Shh. Improving the iron farm. Okay, so here's the problem. All right. Well, you guys already saw the problem, really. The problem is that piglin, er, piglins, uh, iron golems spawn, and then they, they well, for one, they can get stuck there. Also, uh, they can they sometimes fall out of the farm for some reason, and I don't know why that happens. But it's an issue. And it's an issue that I intend to fix. Uh, hang on, we can easily, like... Yoink. Come on. Yoink. Yoink. Ugh. You would be difficult. Yep, yeah, so one of the first problems, um... Uh, I believe if I dam that off for a minute and then put stair blocks there, it'll work out. That's one fix. Um, I think if I make this wall higher... Now to keep them in a bit better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. But he just like he's stuck. He just like won't come out. He's like, I'm not leaving. You can't make me. Oh, I see. I see the problem. He's getting stuck on the fence. Or the wall. Okay. I know what has to be done. Duh, I almost walked off. Okay. Don't walk off, Colin. That would be bad for your health. Go outward, please. Out. The fuck? The one time I want you to go forward and you go up instead? There we go. Hey, bro. So, these fences need to go. There we go. Instant improvement. Ah, whatever. I have so many scaffolding block. I can get so many scaffolding, it doesn't matter. Scaffoldings. Let's see, which one needs to go? It's uh, below the corner piece. Yep, there we go. Okay, and with that, they should stop getting stuck. But now I need to figure out how to get them to stop coming out of it. And I think I might know what's happening. They might be popping out the top. Yeah, because the water is pretty high. We need more cobblestone walls. See, this guy got out too. Are they just spawning outside? Is that what it is? Do I need to get rid of this platform? Maybe the platform just has to go. That could be the reason. Can I push you? Go down. Go down there. Go down there. Go down there where I can kill you. With less risk to my own safety. 
I, I was like, why is he wandering off into the ocean? And I'm just like, oh, there's a drowned in there. <laughs> okay. That makes more sense now. All right. Three blocks up. Shoot him with a crossbow. Curse out the skeleton for existing. Ah. Uh. I wonder if skeletons know just how much I hate them. Just mobs in general, really. Okay, if you're not going to get out of the water. Oh, yeah, now you want to come out of the water. It's like, now I'm motivated. Come here. Come here, you muscly muscle head. Stupid jock. Stupid jock. Done. All right, we need more cobblestone walls. So my my bet is if we just step, put another layer of cobblestone walls on the back, uh, it should be fine. So I think they're climbing up. They're either spawning on that platform or they're climbing up and then walking around. Um, for the platform, actually, if I replace that platform with slabs, yeah, yeah, I could replace that platform with slabs, like bottom slabs, and then mobs don't path on them, so they shouldn't spawn on there. Yeah, that would, that should, that should work. Um, okay, so, what am I doing? I already forgot. I need cobblestone for walls. Um, I think this is all the cobblestone I have right now. Yeah, okay, so we're gonna... we're gonna get more cobblestone. I'm not sure how many I'm gonna need, so I'm just gonna sit here for a minute. Yeah. Mining away. I don't know what I'm gonna say, I'll say it anyway. Ah, uh, hang on, I'm gonna change up the music real fast. Uh, comfy Beats Playlist. Switch it up a little bit here. Um, I think this is the playlist. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Okay. Uh, shuffle. It's not well. It's not the same place. It's not the same playlist I've been using, but it works. Okay. There we go. All right. Um, got nine so far. Need more. Gonna need way more than that. Such a good use of my diamond pick that I just made before the stream. Mining cobblestone. <laughs> you think the diamond picks like an aristocrat or like a, a, a just a rich person? He's just like, Ugh, I'm too good for this. It's a waste of my talents. You don't know how to use me properly. You know, at some point, I should uh, build. Cause I have that stone generator all the way out by uh, the the spire, right? I should tear this up and then make that stone generator a little closer to home. That'd be nice. That could be a project. It's for another time, though. That should be sufficient. Okay. Alright. Let's go make some walls. And we're gonna put them up. Hey. Okay. Ah, you got out again, huh? <laughs> 
Um, oh yeah, I have to craft, I have to actually like craft <laughs> uh, some blocks, some fences first before I can do this. I forgot to craft the walls. That's a bit important. You know, just a little bit. Um, six times nine is, I don't know how many. 35, 40, no. It would be 45 and then 54. Connor, sorry, idea for a collab so we can get both POV. That's a good idea. We just have to get me to figure out recording. <laughs> uh, you don't have to record it, man. Uh, Twitch will record it. Twitch will hold on to your VOD. You just have to download it. Yep. Yeah, thank and thank you for that math. Um, I don't know that I need that many. Ah, whatever. 55. Psych, it's 55. Haha. <laughs> yeah, it's really easy to do. You just download it. It's not it's not as high quality, but it's not necessarily about the quality, it's about just having it. You can produce quality content without high quality video. It can be done. He's out. Literally, all we're doing, right? So we're just making these fence block, making these walls a little bit higher. And that should keep the golems from sliding out. And if it doesn't, then my other theory uh, will prove correct, which is that the iron golems are not slipping out rather they're spawning on the platform outside there we go um now we need you to get down One more. One more. One more. Bye! Nice. Okay. I'm gonna put this in my offhand so I can get some of the mending from killing the golem right here. Alright. Um, do I have any more arrows? No. Why would I? I don't have anything to hit the golem with, though. Man. This sucks. I suppose you could just just make, like, Stewie, just slap him once and just be like, Hi! <laughs> and just run away. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna have to do. Okay. I'm ready. Eh. Got him. <laughs> Sick prank, bro. Ah. 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 Uh, I didn't get any experience to mend the <laughs> fishing pole with. It's okay. I'm gonna go fishing at some point, just for shits and giggles. I've been meaning to do it, I just, like, haven't. Oh yeah, quick, I put your worst nightmare uh, all around town now. See, there we go, it's already working. They've already spawned more. Now this farm will be way more efficient. All right, hopefully that's a little more, that's, hopefully that's a little bit better. Yeah, I can also put stairs down uh, to keep uh, going.
goms from getting stuck up there, but for the time being, I think we're okay. As long as they don't spawn on that platform anymore, we should be fine. If I had to, I can make the platform smaller. Sweets. I am a happy boy. Grr. To be fair, okay, to be fair, I have no idea why, why you put <laughs> your stuff in that chest at random, but you did. Hey, Quake. Quake's in here. Konnichiwa. Uh, wait, will this, will this work? No, damn, I was gonna, I was gonna try to use the Japanese keyboard. Konnichiwa. It's like, for some reason, get the vibe that Quake's gonna come in here and destroy the trash cans. Yeah, it definitely was not my smartest play. <laughs> yeah, I'm. Sh if you ask John nicely, though, I'm sure John would be like, oh, yeah, sure, I'll, I'll spawn you some stuff. <laughs> Cause it's it's it is kind of a stupid thing to lose your stuff over. I already got one back properly enchanted. Nice. I wish I could work that fast. Ah. <sighs> well, guys, we still have an hour and a half to go on this stream, and I need stuff to do. Hmm. I suppose if we have the time, I might as well just toss in some stairs. I've been playing this game for at least six years, though. That's true. I'm just a beginner. I at least have a pretty good understanding of redstone. I think the only other person on the server who can say that is maybe, like, Danny. <laughs> Me too, it's just tedious. Yeah. I enjoy it, though. Just playing around with it and seeing what you can do with it is really fun for me. Already another goddamn poppy in here. So many poppies. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this. These, uh, walls here. Be careful not to farm the one I'm standing on. I like adding resources and adventuring more. Yeah, see, I would love doing that more if I didn't die every single time I did it. I just, I, this game just loves to, like, throw things at me to get me killed all the damn time. I cannot play this game without something tragic happening. Like, every single time I play it. It sucks. It's the worst. Bye bye, Poppy. Uh, where am I stringing storage at? Here we go. Uh, it's easy to me. Quake's got the right idea. <laughs> Man after my own heart. Likes to play it safe. Is there someone else in the server? No, it's just lagging out. Okay. Okay. Blah, all right. What are we going to do, guys? We need something to do now. Oh, yeah. I was going to just go see Robo's floating island. for something to do. All right. Uh, let's just venture around. Check out the island for a second here. Because I would work on the spire, but that's like a full... That's like a full three-hour stream. 
And I also have to work out how to make the platforms in order for it to work. I haven't quite figured that part out yet. I want to make like a a soul. I I figured I saw a design, uh, for like a soul sand magma elevator. It's like a two way elevator. I would like to make one of those. Just seems really cool. This seems like it's gonna take forever. <laughs> I think Ro would be upset if I made like him like a, just like an elevator. If I can make it look like natural. Yes, fair enough. I don't do it though. Dude, this looks sick actually. Is this, is this green wolf for like moss? That's really smart. Plus we all have elytra. Yeah, but I don't use mine because I John cheated it in. I feel like I feel like I didn't earn it. This house is sick though. Looks best during sunset. It's sick. <laughs> oh my god. It's a dope bed. Chester's for show though. bad we survived it we're fine oh yeah i was gonna like i was gonna light up the area around the village that mobs wouldn't spawn as much how much time you got left uh about like a hour 20 minutes there's also this actually i don't think this is the one that i made That's mine. Whoa. I don't know what you're planning to make down here, but whatever it is, it's probably going to be cool. Need more glowstone? Oh. I had the idea of making like a crawl space somewhere. I don't know where to build it though. Just because crawl spaces are neat. I have, I have like a lot of things I want to try to do, and I just like don't know where to start. I'm gonna try and make a bit of my own trading spot where I have the best trades. That sounds good. And so it doesn't blow up all the time. That too. Yeah, I, I was I was thinking about finally just saying fuck it and just putting torches everywhere near the village. Just really spend some time on that. The zombies will finally just go the hell away and leave everyone alone. How many torches do I have right now? 25? Uh, how much coal do I have? Quite a bit. Um, I could probably make a lot of torches with this amount of coal. I also have a ton of infinite bamboo at this point, pretty much, so I could also make a ton of sticks. Fuck it. Lighting up the world because I'm sick of creepers. There we go. We've got time. Let's make let's make some good use of it. Yeah. Not a bad idea. Yep. It's a great idea. As a matter of fact.
by the time I'm done with this place, there will be there will never be a mob spawn near the village ever again by the time I'm through. Mark my words. The only place I'm not lighting up is the swamp, because I want slimes there. Slimes make sticky pistons, and sticky pistons are good. Um, is the sun going down already? No, it's just early day. Actually, no, it's noon. Never mind. I'm dumb. Hey, chat, did you know I'm fucking stupid? <laughs> How long have you played in the server? I don't know. Long enough that I should have more shit than what I have, for sure. You can check in statistics. I don't know where. Minecraft is a lot of memory. Holy shit. Menu button. Oh. Oh. Animals bred 108 because of the farm. Uh. Where is it? Sneak time, 2.31 hours. Time since last death, four hours. <laughs> four and a half hours. Time played, uh, two days. Yeah. Hey, quick. Right behind you. Ah! 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 I'm at 1.62 days. Um, stuff like this is spawn right here, too. We gotta give the trees special treatment because of the shade. Mm, that should be good. All oh, the bamboo around here is like not lit well enough. This shit's up. I was ready to purchase. Okay. Um, this is begging for mobs to spawn. Oh yeah, by the way, Quake, I, I know why your mob tower is not working. I was thinking about it the other day, and I figured it out. Uh, there is a reason I built mine over the ocean. Uh, because you need it to you need mobs to only be able to spawn in that room up top. So either you have to move over to the ocean, at which point you might as well just help me work on the, the spire. Or you have to illuminate every single cave within 100 blocks of your tower. This bitch up. Plus, Dan was like, "You gross, it's ugly." So John blew it up. <laughs> it's so mean. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Next time, next time I stream Minecraft, let's like, uh, let's make some plants or something. We can like, we can work on the spire. The spire is pretty much done. I just need it to have like more platforms so things actually spawn. I'm still working out like how to get things to spawn on it. For once, I'm actually glad it's dark because now I can actually see how well these torches are working. Yeah, 
This should really be like a community effort. <laughs> But if I have to one-man army this, so be it. <laughs> I will make this my mission. And you better fucking believe I will succeed at it. Mark my words. The cave right here. They still spawn below me. Good. If they If they constantly spawn below us, that's fine. We're not going down there. Coal. Coal means more torches. Now I'm built up. Hmm. Oh, you're talking about the mob tower. I thought you were talking about uh, something else. Uh. Yeah, I mean, you just have to, like, illuminate caves and such. Get him to not spawn. Um, that's probably part of my problem too. Uh, I need to uh, light up uh, more of the area around my tower. I think. I might, I might take a detour at some point and do that. I'm talking about where I am outside my house. Oh. They are still spawning. Mob spawner! <laughs> Nature's mob spawner. <laughs> yeah, I'd actually totally be okay with making this like a community project and just like in streaming it. And then John can just like, if John's with us, he can use his god powers to just keep it so that it's like eternally night. So that we can see where mobs are spawning and then put torches there. Be a fun time. I have to disconnect. Hold on. Okay. Nope, still night. Waiting, 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 waiting. Okay. There we go. You redeem sound alert re, but it didn't play. That's not good. Oh, we have if it was visible. Uh, I got you, Quake. Hold on. I got you, Quake. Don't even worry about it. I got you, man. What did I just do? <laughs> I don't... I think I just closed that tab by accident. Oops. Uh, hang on. Let me... Hopefully I don't get attacked while I'm doing this. That would suck. And now that I've said it, I'm going to jinx myself and it's going to happen. Uh, configure, open sound loads dashboard. Re there you go. There's your re. <laughs> I got you, dude. I got you, brother. There. It's visible now, so it'll actually work. Hello, Quake. I see you. I see you. <laughs> that was almost super smooth. <laughs> I don't need to go too far out with my torches. I just need enough of the area around the village lit up that mobs don't spawn and wander in from outside. It's kind of my goal. 
the idea being that if you go to the outskirts of the village and you get attacked, then you get what you get. Yeah, this will probably have to become this will probably end up being like a community effort sort of thing. Because I think I believe I would like to think that I speak for everyone when I say that I'm sick of creepers blowing up my shit. Like when I was preparing for the stream today, a creeper spawned inside my house because I guess it was just dark enough and it was just waiting in my house on the bed. Like, hey baby, why don't you come on the bed and we can have a have an explosive time? And he just blew up my wall. I'm still kind of pissed about it, actually. I need to remember this place for the, later. I just got an idea, but I don't want to say it. Diligent viewers will know what I'm talking about. snazzy looking fine looking mighty nice out here there's a random bone just sitting in there bye quick yoink <laughs> mine now <laughs> back to you later Colin. see you quick Love that boy. Make sure you go get that boy a follow on Twitch, by the way. He streams sometimes. Not often, but when he does, it's a good time. Uh oh. Gonna wanna eat some steak before going into this one. I turn in the pot pie with a sword. <laughs> oh, they're spawning in here. Not anymore. Not anymore. There we go. Okay. Um, we get some scaffolds going. We just uh No, that's not my scaffolds. It's my scaffolds. Okay. Easy. GG easy. This area around here is like Mob City. And I am running out of torches. Um, I have a little bit more coal. It's not much, but it'll have to do. The last torches, we gotta make them count. Bam. Ah, bam. This isn't just about me. It's about the whole village. We must protect the people. And the creatures of the dark. Mm. 
need more coal. Ah, oh, let's see. Have any iron golems spawned outside? Nope. Dude, that's looking snazzy. Heck yeah. Love it when things work. It's one of my favorite things, when things actually work. You know what I mean? It's always just nice. Okay. And Nihu. Back to house. I'm gonna hang out until nighttime and see how well those torches work. See if we still get like crazy mob spawn rates or not. Uh. Okay. I have oak planks in here already. Ah, oh, my chest is full of bones. It's already full of bones. Got too many bones. It's a shame. Uh, I could sell some of this rotten flesh for money, though. Well, I see that I've dropped down to one viewer, so it might be time to call it here, but... Let me just call it a little bit early. Being able to do one three-hour Minecraft stream a, a week, in, in all honesty, was a little bit of wishful thinking. But what can you do? Uh, let's see, do I have anything I can sell for emeralds right now? What do I have that can go? Uh, not much. I guess there's paper. Or waiting for the dark. We. Because <laughs> I get stuck on my boat here. Slowly getting darker. Ooh, we're getting there. Okay. Uh, let's see. You, sir. Uh, I can't trade with. Dried kelp blocks? Oh, I could easily make those. Oh, you take sweet berries too? Shit, I got sweet berries. I'll have to harvest sweet berries for money. Yep, anyway, give me give me emeralds for that. Please and thank you, sir. Um also want to have my cleric over here. Cleric cleric over here is my boy. Oh yeah, Quake needs glowstone. Maybe, maybe, maybe I have to buy some glowstone for uh wait. Enough rotten flesh for one. Once we get the mob farm working, then we will have all kinds of rotten flesh for trading. Do I have anything else to get rid of? Um, I don't think so. That's okay though, because now it's night. I saw a spider. No, never mind. It wasn't a spider. It was a poppy. False alarm. Yep, see, there are Zambos just way on the outside of the village. See, there's, all the mobs are spawning much farther away now. Which means as long as you don't run in from the outskirts of the village, like, it should be fine. Oh, you know what? I just got an idea for a project. Maybe... 
the next project should be like an elytra landing platform and like takeoff platform which i guess that base already is that i wonder if ash would let me build a platform off of her base for elytras It would be an excuse to make my elevator that I wanted to make. By the way, there's lava under this. I don't know why it's here, but I buried it because it's just like, look at this. This lava was just sitting open in one in just one block of lava, just randomly in the village for no reason. And I was just like, someone, someone's gonna walk into that. And by someone, I mean me. And so I buried it for safekeeping. This village is just a fire hazard. We need to have it. <laughs> ah, no random mobs or creepers anywhere though so far. The real test though is the farm. Uh, the, where all the farms are, that's the test. Because the majority of the mobs love to spawn over here. But it would seem there are none. That's mission accomplished, guys. Sick dicks. Well, you know what? I might call it a stream here. I was, and I was supposed to go for a full hour, but or, or another hour, but uh, it would seem that people aren't done watching for today, so I'm going to be done streaming for today, I think. Mostly because I'm just out of stuff to do. Except for maybe, like, fish. Go fishing. See what kind of fish are biting today. This rod's supposed to have lure one, but I feel like... <laughs> there we go. Fishy. I don't have much reason to fish, though. Now, not, not that I have, now that I have the cow farm. It's like, whatever. Fishing is irrelevant. Yeah, I think that's going to be it for me today, guys. Damn. We got some stuff accomplished, though. I, I set out... I did everything I set out to do today. We got trash cans in the village. Uh, I showed you guys the Piglin mob farm. Uh, we improved the iron farm, and we lit up the village, so now mobs won't spawn as much. That's a good day, in my opinion. Uh, I'm going to need to figure out what project I want to do next. Uh... I have a lot of ideas. We could work on the spire. We could uh, make the elytra takeoff platform. And also landing pad. I want to have like a landing pad. I want to make a landing pad out of something soft so that people don't hit the ground too hard. Because <laughs> that's a constant fear. Yeah, I'll, I'll think of something. Yeah, uh, real quick. Uh, Ali is alive. Thank you for the raid. I really appreciate it. I feel like I would have had like no viewers without that raid, more than likely. Uh, but yeah, tomorrow. Today is Thursday, right? Yeah, so tomorrow. Oh yeah, that's right. Tomorrow we're playing Monster Hunter on stream. I'm so excited. I cannot wait. I'm I've been wanting to play it and holding off on it. Uh, for the stream tomorrow. But yeah, we're gonna be playing Monster Hunter Rise. Uh, tomorrow at five. Uh, 5 p.m. EDT for the first time. So come see that if you are interested in that. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm pretty much done here. Uh, I think I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm the only person watching at this point. Which is fine. Which is fine. It's honestly though, it's probably just a bunch of lurkers. I think I, got, I might have some lurkers in chat. I don't know. I don't know if Twitch counts lurkers or not. I still don't quite know how the view count works, but yeah. 
I'm 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 done for today. I'm gonna get this vod up on YouTube, get some food. I gotta I should probably work on some thumbnails. I haven't done thumbnails at all since Sunday. Yeah, why am I so quiet all of a sudden? Why am I quiet? The fuck? Like my voice changer is on, but I'm still quiet for some reason. That's weird. I don't know. I'll work it out off stream. Uh yeah, I'm done. I'll find you guys someone to watch. Uh, hopefully someone more interesting than me. And yeah. Bye, everybody. Oh, follow and join the Discord and all that fun stuff. Forgot to say that.